Do all these engine and gas treatments have you wondering what to buy? Let's have Bill from XL Plus explain what the others contain, what they do, and don't do. Bill, I feel like I'm in a store now. Uh, this is uh, a lot of stuff. Uh, I see we have our, our hero product here, but briefly tell the folks, what, what is this? What's, what's this all about? If you go into a parts store or a department store right. and you go to the automotive section, you right. look at, at the products they have available, there are all kinds of them on the shelf. Mm -hmm. And Never consumers, <laughs> this is a small segment. Mm -hmm. I, I wanted to bring them all in, but I had to fill the studio to do that. Okay. Well, <laughs> if you take all the products, take the labels off, they'll fit into a category. Okay. Uh, you have oil thickeners, you have oil cleaners. Okay. We're still dealing with oil in these. All right. We're dealing here with metals uh, with extreme pressure property lubricants. Is that which, bad? Well, they contain either chlorine, phosphorus, or sulfur. Okay. And what will happen is you'll either create a hydrochloric, phosphoric, or sulfuric acid in your engine. Uh, if the oil industry is trying to take those compounds out, why would you want to add them? So these, are, these have chemicals in there we may not want in our engines? Probably not. Okay. What about these folks? These guys have solids. Uh, you'll find they have either PTFE or moly or a graphite. And wh what does that mean to them out there? Uh, what it means is you're putting a solid in your engine. Okay. Uh, well, just the Teflon theory alone, uh, if you take a frying pan that you've got at home and use a fork on it, the, the coating comes off. Right. All right. Well, then, if you put Teflon in an engine, remember that piston? Mm hmm It has rings on it that scrape up and down. Yeah, the ones that work, they kept going right. around after, I think, 190,000 miles. 220. Okay. So, if, if you got that scraping up and down, it would keep scraping the coating off. Okay. So, this, is, this has something in here that you may not want in your engine. I wouldn't. Okay, so, and, and studying the market for as long as you have, and getting down grassroots in the trenches, researching, which maybe some major companies haven't or have not done, I don't know. But we go back to Excel Plus. Right. Again, we can't tell them it's number one yet, but they, they can tell us pretty soon, wouldn't you think? Well, the product will sell itself. Okay. And, and in fact, one of the reports we have is from a major engine manufacturer that stated they couldn't test it in a lab, and the only place to really test it was in the field. Okay. That's in your car.